Good morning, Mossville Warriors. Today is Tuesday, September 24th, 2024, and today is National Punctuation Day. National Punctuation Day commemorates all punctuation on September 24th. A period, a comma, a semicolon, a question mark, and an exclamation point are examples of some of the punctuation used in writing. They separate sentences and their elements to clarify meaning. Without them, meaning could be lost or up for interpretation. Now will everybody please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Mossville Pledge. As a Mossville warrior, I pledge to do my best today and to be the best I can be. At Mossville School, I am respectful, responsible, and safe. This is the Warrior Way. This week in our Lions Quest program, we will focus on what success means and how positive values contribute to our success in school and in life. Our quote is, I won't do it. I can't do it. I want to do it. How do I do it? I will try to do it. I can do it. I will do it. Yes, I did it. Which step will you take? This week, think about a success story of your own. Recall a time when you had a purpose, set a goal, and used your positive values to guide your choices. What is your story of success? Take a moment to really enjoy that memory and then look for an opportunity to share that success with someone who might be motivated or inspired by hearing it. Celebrate your successes this week. Our word of the week is motivation. Daily reminders, bring your lunch card every day to the cafeteria. Remember, if you do not have your lunch card, you cannot get anything off of the cart. Also, if you have a negative balance of more than $10, you cannot get anything off of the cart. Make sure you're getting to class on time. Avoid those tardies. Make sure to avoid zeros. And lastly, be kind. We do not have any birthdays today. Congratulations to the cross-country warriors who ran well at the St. Jude Invitational. Ellie Kurohusky finished second. Alana Ferencrug, 14th. Lauren Crook, 17th. Andre Robel, 28th. And Aaron Braun, 34th, earning medals. The girls team placed second overall out of 15 teams. On the boys' side, Brody Miller finished second, Caleb Walshmitt placed third, Hunter Surratt 17th, and Owen Gillette placed 24th, all earning medals. The boys' team placed fourth overall out of 13 teams. This day in history. On this day in 1789, the U.S. Federal Judiciary Act was passed, creating a six-member Supreme Court, and President George Washington nominated John Jay for the first Chief Justice. Activities Day, we've got speech practice right after school and cheer trial practice at 5.30 p.m. Another celebration is the boys' baseball team's win versus Sparlin in the quarterfinals. They will next take on CEC in the semifinals at Washington Middle School. Way to go, Warriors! For lunch today, we have chicken parmesan flatbread, yogurt and pretzel pack, or some butter and jelly. Our sides are cooked carrots or broccoli and assorted fruit. And remember, it's a great day to be a warrior.